the meeting we had the other day was five hours, and uh, talking Luana was ten minutes. <laughs> we we had so many other things we were going over, and uh, we unanimously decided in that meeting right away that Luana was going to, uh, we were going to support her staying as a president because uh, there's so many more things going at the university than, than just this Nasser thing. Ferguson went on to say that Simon should remain as president because she's a prolific fundraiser for the school. When you go to the basketball game, you walk in that um, the New Breslin, and the person who, who hustled and got all those major donors to they give money was Luana Simon. I think that is perhaps the most insulting thing that has come out of this man's mouth. This Nasser thing to him, well, this has consumed my entire life as well as hundreds of other women here. Morgan McCall was sexually assaulted by Nasser for years, starting when she was only 12. She's been in the courtroom since last week, supporting others abused by Nasser. Do you know how many hours I've spent in court this week? How many has Joel Ferguson spent in court? Ferguson also bristled at the suggestion that the NCAA should investigate and possibly penalize Michigan State, as it did with Penn State over Jerry Sandusky's abuses. This, this is not Penn State, uh, and uh, this is they had they were dealing with their football program. Uh, I, I do not see the and 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 they're they're smart enough to know they're not competent to walk in here on this. Wow. Well. I think that is sexism at its finest. Perhaps he should learn to keep his mouth shut. Now, by the numbers, this scandal is actually worse than Penn State. They had about 30-some victims. The Larry Nasser sex abuse scandal has about 150. Now, in response to Ferguson's comments, two of his colleagues on the Board of Trustees have responded. Brian was solemn and also a trustee Lyons saying that they spent much more than just 10 minutes talking about Luana Simon and the Larry Nasser scandal. It was the better part of their almost five hour meeting. Also, Mr. Musalem tweeted, we have come across as tone deaf, insensitive, emotionless, and it infuriates me. We're live in Lansing tonight. I'm Ross Jones, 7 Action News.